Hi guys, um, in today's video I'm going to show you how to create a dimple like this one, or this one, or this one, or this one, uh, using a homemade dimple die that it's uh, made out of, uh, I don't know, scraps and nothing fancy. Uh, you can buy dimple dies online, but uh, I found out that they're pretty expensive, at least when you buy a complete set. I'm sure that uh, if you're doing this uh, at a professional level, uh, they worth their money in gold, but uh, if you do this like me, I don't know, once in a while, uh, you can choose a cheaper alternative. In this case, I'm going to show you how, to, how I created uh, these dimples. So basically, what I have did was to pick up some uh, I know, scraps of aluminum. For example, none of these uh, scraps are bought there. For example, this uh, rod is out of a car shock. Um, this I don't know, cylinder uh, was found when I was uh, on a riverbed while fishing. Uh, this is from the rotor of a water pump and a washer and a nut. To create a dimple it's pretty simple. Basically what you need to do is to, or how the dimple is created, is that you need to force this piece through the metal while it's backed up by this one. So basically when you tighten the nut right here on this rod, you're going to get this dimple right here. But I think that the best for, uh, for you would be to show it how it's done. Okay now, so uh, this rod it's now clamped in this vise. Uh, the first piece that must go in it's uh, in this case is this one, the smaller one. A good tip for a better finish is to spray the surfaces with some cutting oil or just WD-40 or just plain uh, engine oil. Okay, now. We're going to spray uh, both of the sides. Just going to clamp the metal sheet using the, the bigger cylinder. And right now, you just need to tighten this nut. And as as we tighten the nut, uh, the thing is that the, the, the metal is forced inside the big cylinder by the small one. And by using the, this method you can create uh, lots of, of sizes, but uh, you just need to find uh, the matching cylinders. Uh, in this case I was lucky, but if you have a, a late, even a Chinese one, you can create all, sh all the sizes you, you need. And as you can see, this is the result. Both sides. It's. Uh, I'm pretty happy how it turned out because, as I told you, these are just recycled parts, and uh, there's nothing too fancy about it. But uh, it's a clever solution on how to make dimples using some, uh, I don't know, bow legged dimple dies. Well, that's kind of it. Have a good one.